Following a failed moonshot, a U.S. company's lunar lander, Astrobotic Technologies Paragon is set to re-enter Earth's atmosphere and burn up soon. The lander, which departed from Cape Canaveral last Monday, encountered a fuel leak, compelling Astrobotic to abandon its mission to achieve the first U.S. lunar landing in over 50 years. Suspecting a stuck valve causing a tank rupture, the company, in collaboration with NASA, is closely monitoring the lander's trajectory to ensure a safe re-entry with expectations for the mission to conclude on Thursday. Astrobotic, having consulted with NASA and government officials, prioritizes avoiding risks to Earth's satellites and future lunar spacecraft, Yahoo Finance reported. NASA invested over $100 million for experiments on the Peregrine lander as part of its initiative to commercialize lunar deliveries by private entities while the government focuses on returning astronauts to the moon. Peregrine has also carried a rover for the Carney Mellon University, privately sponsored research, and the ashes and DNA of around 70 individuals, including Star Trek creator Gene Roddenberry and science fiction author Arthur C. Clarke. Another U.S. company, Intuitive Machines, is poised for its lunar lander launch next month.